Merging cells means combining several individual cells to create a bigger one. There are many applications for it. For example, you might want a single title for multiple columns. In this guide, we'll help you understand when and how you can merge cells in Google Sheets. Let's consider this example spreadsheet, where both employee and department details are given. The title employee detail should ideally span across three columns, employee ID, employee name, and phone number. Similarly, the department details should span across department name and manager name. Let's see how we can merge them. First, we're gonna highlight cell A1 to C1. We're going to visit the format menu and go to merge cells and then click merge all. Notice that the three cells have now been combined into one and the dividing grid line has disappeared. We're going to repeat the process for department details. Go to format again and then merge cells, merge all. You can change the alignment of the cells by going to horizontal align and then left, center, or right. There is another way to merge cells. You simply click the merge cells button in the ribbon when you have the correct cells highlighted. It's important to note that when you merge multiple cells where all of them contain data, only data in the top leftmost cell is retained. But if you do make a mistake, Google Sheets will warn you. If I highlight these three cells and click merge all, it will tell us that only the top leftmost value will be preserved. Now, when we went to format merge cells, we clicked on merge all. Now let's take a quick look at the other options. Merge all will merge all selected cells and create a bigger cell. Merge horizontally will merge cells in the same row. Merge vertically will merge cells in the same column. And unmerge will unmerge the cells. Now, when you do merge cells, it can create some problems. For example, you cannot sort a column if it has merged cells. The second issue that you might come across is that if you copy a merged cell to another location in the spreadsheet, it will copy the entire range and not just the data. So if we copy the merged cell to another location, it will result in a merged cell at the destination too. But overall, merging cells is pretty straightforward. You can merge them and unmerge them with just a few clicks. Next, we will be looking at formatting numbers and currencies.